when a cow is in heat, she's bullying. Well, there's a short window of time to get her inseminated. So it's extremely important to get the semen delivered on time. And in Kenya, you're going to remote rural locations. The roads are not very good, which is why you have the dirt bikes. It's very high risk, but when they get to the farm, they get the semen out and find the cow, and the magic happens. This is the story of how better cows led to better grades. It'll all make sense in a minute, but first, let's talk about selective breeding. This is Professor Kofe. Despite my youthful appearance, I've been around a long time. And this is Professor Emrode. He wrote the book on this stuff. I wrote this book. Up in Edinburgh, these two have been researching selective breeding for decades. Where genomics started, it totally changed the game. What is the genetic ability of this cow to actually it's produce DNA? Basically, it's like a dating app for cows. By mating them to the best animals, the resulting offspring are better, like a Jack Russell to produce a Jackapoo, so we can make cattle that produce as much milk as possible. And it's helping dairy farmers all over the UK. Since we started the project, we're doing about a thousand litres per cow per year extra. This data was shared with other countries, but they adapted the science to build their own selective breeding programmes. In Africa, the difference in milk productivity was so huge versus in the UK. And as we saw what they were doing, the question was, can we do it here? I think I would say yes. But nobody was ready to invest in Africa because genetics takes too long. But the Gates Foundation, they were ready to actually take the risk and invest. And so we put together a team. The team knew that the same cow Rory needed in Scotland wasn't the same cow they need down here in Kenya. So we collect a lot of data around the farm. Then we use the SARS to translate that data into information and share that knowledge with the farmers. And when the information that's helped you to produce a better cow, now you can actually change the quantity of product, which is milk. Milk is a white gold. When we started, the dairy farmers were only producing six liters per day per cow. Now they are producing 10. With our partners in the UK, we are co-creating solutions, sharing successes, celebrating together. The work that we do, the numbers that we calculate, equations that RAF tells us to implement, all of that creates this product that can increase the livelihood of thousands of people. And the farmers are really, really proud. Like our friend Josephine here. I'm happy because we have milk. There is plenty for my family also. It's a source of income which has helped us in paying for my children's education. I can now enable them to become what they have dreamed to become in the future. And that, my friends, is how better cows can lead to better grades. The Gates Foundation, partners of human potential. <laughs>